35-3 Hampshire Guild. I think this one is built for the big green. I think she's built to do big things, um, and I'm very excited to see where this one may end up. Man, this one walked in, and uh, one of the really special ones offered in this group. And I know Hampshire Gilts uh, at this age can be a little challenging to find. And, uh, you know, I have guys ask, where are the Hamp Gilts? Where are the Hamp Gilts? And uh, Autry's is a good place to start. And I think regardless of who you ask, uh, Brad, Kyle, Tyler, uh, Brandy, anybody, it doesn't matter. Uh, they're going to tell you this Dash 3 special. And just one that, uh, you know, kind of combines the positives uh, of her litter mates in this group. She's got the added uh, attractiveness and just balance of, of the really neat outline when we just got done talking about. Yet yeah, she's got a little more bulk and chunk to her. I uh, like the really stout modern, moderate one we just talked about. Uh, this thing to me, I mean, just talk about checking boxes and hamsters that can drive at you that strong prop and balance like that, but yet still be ladylike in terms of their rib cage, a uh, right in terms of their muscle pattern she's not too much she's not too skinny uh, to me this one just does lots of good things and if you've asked about Hampshire guilts and where they're at I found one for you because this dash two an extra spur dash three sorry this dash three is special in so many different areas and like I talked in these uh, this thing looks versatile it looks like you could get a lot of miles out of her you could jackpot her early uh, you could run her into the summer and I think man better days ahead but yet at the same time a high quality one here that sticks out in this group